Burkina Faso. Burkina Faso views its second coup d'etat on TV in one year. On late Friday night, September 30th, 2022, Burkina Faso witnessed its second coup d'etat this year. Approximately two dozen soldiers dressed in fatigues and wearing face masks appeared on national television to announce the overthrow of coup leader come interim president Colonel Paul Henri Damiba, whose whereabouts are still unknown. As reported in Associate Press, Captain Kiswinsida Farouk Azaria Sorgo, spokesman for the new junta led by Captain Ibrahim Traore, read on live television, quote, faced by the continually worsening security situation, we, the officers and junior officers of the National Armed Forces, were motivated to take action with a desire to protect the security and integrity of our country, unquote. These words are eerily similar to those spoken when the coup under the leadership of Colonel Damiba took place to overthrow the government of President Roche Kabore in January of this year. The new junta announced that a new transitional charter would be adopted soon and that a new civilian or military president would be appointed, according to Reuters. The statement read on television stated that Damiba refused to listen to his subordinate officers who recommended he change the structure of the military, which in their opinion was the same as it was during the Kabore administration, as per Reuters. Burkina Faso has recently been racked by Al-Qaeda and Islamic State-linked insurgencies that killed thousands and displaced millions.